LED face masks are everywhere right now, and your favorite celebrities are posting selfies looking like they're about to join the Avengers, and many companies are marketing these masks like they can reverse time better than the DeLorean. But do they actually work, or are we all just cosplaying as Avengers with expensive face jewelry? Today, I'm breaking down the real science behind LED therapy and when it's worth your money and when you'd be better off spending it at the arcade. By the end of this video, you'll know the actual science behind LED therapy and where it fits into a smart skincare routine and who is the ideal candidate to utilize LED therapy. Plus, I'm going to explain why most LED masks are no better than an expensive nightlight and which wavelengths are actually important for your skin. If you're new here, I'm Dr. Dustin. I'm a board certified dermatologist and I make videos to help you fight the illness industrial complex. That's basically anybody, whether it's pharmaceuticals, the supplement industry, wellness influencers who want to market to you based on fear. They want to take away your choice and convince you that you need something when maybe you don't. And that's why we're doing an honest review today of the You Like Reglow LED mask because I only partner with companies that pass the would I recommend this to my mom test. Now that we've got that out of the way, let's dive into LED therapy. LED therapy uses specific wavelengths of light that pass into your skin cells and basically give your cells a pep talk. Different wavelengths of light can trigger different things to happen in your skin. And that's why there's not just one wavelength that can do everything. The You Like Reglow LED mask contains four different types of LEDs that stimulate different processes in the skin, starting with red light, of course. At 630 nanometers, this is like your collagen cheerleader, telling your cells to make more collagen so your skin gets more firm and more plump. Red LEDs can also help to calm inflammation in the skin, making it great to use post-procedure. Next up is 590 nanometer yellow light. This is the peacekeeper in your skin. This is going to help calm inflammation and irritation and strengthen your skin barrier. Next up is 465 nanometer blue light. This is the acne fighter. It directly works on the bacteria that cause acne. So if your skin is breaking out, blue light can be very helpful. And lastly, 830 nanometer infrared light. This is beyond the visible spectrum that we can see. It penetrates deeper into the skin for a more rich collagen production boost. It's a great pep talk for your skin cells. When the right wavelengths hit your skin cells, it's like giving them their morning coffee, getting them woken up and telling them it's time to make some more collagen. And this is crucial. It only works if you have the right wavelengths at the right intensity and you're willing to use it consistently. And that's where a lot of devices on the market fail harder than my attempts to do TikTok dances. Trust me, you don't want to see that. As a dermatologist, I've seen more LED devices than a DJ at a nightclub. Most of the ones that have been sent to me have ended up as a white elephant gift, but this one actually made me raise my eyebrows in a good way. I haven't talked about a ton of devices on my channels, but let me tell you why I don't hate this one. First up is the 360 degree mirror reflection technology. This is actually patented by Ulight. It's not just fancy marketing speak, it has a mirror on the inside that boosts the irradiance of the LEDs by 77.4%. It's kind of like the difference between a flashlight and a laser pointer. You're definitely getting a bigger boost of light when you use the reglow from Ulight. Another reason that I actually like the You Like Reglow LED mask is it has four different treatment modes and each treatment mode doesn't just use one of the LED types. It actually mixes and matches depending on what you're trying to accomplish for your skin. Let's start off with the glow mode. This uses red plus infrared plus yellow light to actually help to reduce pigmentation in your skin. It's the one that I've been using most frequently because I never wore sunscreen as a kid and I'm starting to get some brown spots. So between procedures that I do in the office, I've been using the Reglow LED at home. Next up is the firm mode, which uses the red plus the infrared light for when gravity is winning the war against your jawline. This is gonna help stimulate collagen production and give your skin a more firm appearance and reduce fine lines and wrinkles. The next mode is Rejuvenate, and this is yellow plus infrared light for when your skin barrier has trust issues. If you've got super sensitive skin, that's probably the one that's going to help calm things down the best. And the last one is Clear Mode. This is for those that are struggling with acne at 35. It uses blue plus red light to help fight the acne causing bacteria and reduce unwanted pigmentation. The next blockbuster feature is the one centimeter spacing between the LED diodes. So you get the right intensity, but not too much that you're actually gonna burn yourself from the heat of the LEDs. Trust me, it's no fun explaining that to a patient who's overused the wrong kind of LED mask. And the last breakout feature that I wanna talk about on the You Like Reglow is that it has 272 LEDs on here. There's four per module 
covering all the different wavelengths that I have already talked about. A lot of masks just don't have a lot of LEDs in them. They might have 30 LEDs and call it a day. So between 30 to 272 is like the difference between having a string quartet and a full orchestra doing work for your skin. Now, all of those features are great, but if it doesn't actually work in practice, then you're gonna be wasting your money. So it's important that we actually dive into the clinical data because ULIKE has done some important studies. In a 14-day clinical study, there was a 12.9% boost in skin radiance. That's the, I wake up like this type of feeling. There was a 20% increase in smoother skin. So think about less texture, fine lines, and wrinkles. In that study, we also saw a 39.4% reduction in fine lines and wrinkles. Say goodbye to the crow's feet. And lastly, a 61.76 improvement in acne. So your teenage self would be jealous that you didn't have this. Now that might sound impressive, but the thing is, this wasn't just a patient survey where they asked them, yeah, I think my skin looks a little better type of thing. They used actual scientific instruments. They objectively measured things like collagen density with ultrasound, they used a corneometer for hydration, and they used high definition cameras to measure skin elasticity. So the data that I'm sharing here is actual science, not just wishful thinking with expensive lights. So as a dermatologist, how do I actually use this device and how do I recommend it to my patients and to my mom? I've seen patients spend hundreds and thousands of dollars on professional treatments that they maybe do once in their life or every few years. But the thing is, consistency beats intensity in most cases. And if you can use something consistently with a good skincare routine, you're gonna see great results over time. I've started recommending at-home LED treatments to my patients who want to do something to maintain their skin between professional treatments. It's also great for those who have mild to moderate skin concerns who maybe don't need professional treatments in the office just yet. I also only recommend these devices to people who will be committed to use them consistently because I don't want you spending money on something that's gonna sit in the drawer in the bathroom. And lastly, and probably the most important thing is I only recommend these kinds of devices to people who have already mastered the skincare basics. Think about sunscreen, vitamin C, and retinol. If you're not doing the basics, an LED mask isn't going to save you. So knowing all of that, let's break down the actual pros and cons of getting the ULIKE Reglow LED mask. Let's start off with the pros. It actually works. Shocking, I know. The ULIKE Reglow mask is actually FDA certified. They did their homework. It has a true hands-free design. You can wear this while you're walking around the house using the battery pack and get a treatment without slowing down your day. It's got four different modes to target specific skin concerns and those can change over the course of your life and you won't have to buy a new device when your skin needs something else. And lastly, it is cheaper than professional treatments. A device like this, when used consistently, will absolutely pay for itself over time. So let's talk about the cons because we're always gonna give you a fair take on this. First off, there is an upfront investment. The mask retails at $399, but if you use my discount code, you're gonna get a better deal than that. But this is not a subscription thing. Once you buy it, it's yours forever. You don't have to keep paying a monthly subscription like Netflix. Second, it requires consistency. You actually have to use it and use it consistently. This is not the type of thing that you're going to get away with using just a couple times a month and expect to see results. Third, it's really going to take four to six weeks to see significant results. Patients not included in the box. You have to have that on your own. Also, it might make you look like a sci-fi character. I kind of like that feature, but it is gonna look a little funny, so maybe close your windows while you're walking around the house. And lastly, it's not suitable for everyone. If you have severe skin concerns, it's probably not the device that's going to fix those. That's where a consultation with a dermatologist is going to be helpful. So given all of that, who should buy this device and does it pass my, would I recommend it to my mom test? This device is perfect for the following people. Those aged 25 to 60 who have realistic expectations. People who actually follow through on things. That's where the consistency comes in. Anybody who has mastered the skincare basics. Think sunscreen people. Anyone who's tired of going into offices and doing expensive treatments month after month. And anybody who enjoys looking like they're from the future. So who is this device not for? anybody who expects a miracle. This isn't Hogwarts. It's not gonna be a miracle overnight. It's also not good for people who are inconsistent. If you're not going to use it frequently, don't buy the device. If you have incredibly sensitive skin and you struggle to find anything that works well for you, I wouldn't buy this device until you talk to your dermatologist to determine if it might be right for you. And lastly, anybody who expects an overnight transformation, Rome wasn't built in a day, neither is perfect skin. You've gotta be consistent and use it over time, before you're gonna see any of the results. And I do have to share an important note with you. Do not use this device if you're pregnant, 
take certain medications, or you're undergoing treatment for skin cancer. Talk to your dermatologist first in all of those cases. As we wrap up, here's what I really want you to understand. Good skin is not about having the most expensive skincare routine or every fancy gadget out there. The illness industrial complex wants you to believe that you can only get good health or good skin by spending on the latest supplements, gadgets, pharmaceuticals. But the truth is, if you want great skin, you really don't have to spend a lot of money. If you're doing the consistent basics like sunscreen every single day, retinol, vitamin C, you're likely to have very good skin. If you want to add on top of that, something like the Ulike Reglow LED mask is the device that I would recommend for your home use. This device is very nice. It's incredibly comfortable to use and I can do anything that I need to at home while wearing the device. But it's not gonna save you if you're not doing the basics in your skincare routine and you like understands that and they want you to pair it with an excellent skincare routine because they want you to get great results. I want you to get great results and we both know that this mask can help when you're doing the other things that are good for your skin. That also includes a healthy diet and good sleep. There's so many things you need to understand for your health and I talk about them on this channel all the time. You have more power over your skin health than you realize. Sometimes that power comes in the form of a space age mask. Sometimes it comes in the form of daily sunscreen and both of those approaches are very valid. So here's my final verdict. Do I recommend this mask and would I recommend it to my mother? Yes. If you're willing to use it consistently and you're already doing the basics in your skincare routine and you're otherwise a good candidate for it based on the pros and cons that we've already talked about. If you start using this, you'll start to notice smoother skin in the first one to two weeks. It'll be subtle, but it'll definitely be there. After four to six weeks, you're going to notice a reduction in fine lines and wrinkles and continue to see an improved firmness to your skin. And after eight weeks and with continued use, you're gonna notice just improved skin quality, texture, tone, pigmentation. That's where the real benefits are gonna to start to add up over time when you consistently use it. If you wanna try the You Like Reglow LED mask, I've got a special discount code for you. There's a link down at the top of the video description and use my code 208SKIN, that's 208SKIN, for a special discount plus $80 free hydrating facial masks. Who doesn't love a good face mask? Again, that link is down in the description and if you try it, please come back and let me know what you think of the mask when you use it over time. I would love to know about your experience and I want to thank you like for sponsoring this video and helping me to break down the science of something that is a very confusing topic with so many devices on the market that you can choose. This is the one that I have found easiest to use consistently at home. The battery pack lasts plenty of time to get a couple of treatments in on the same day. I charge it after I'm done and it's super easy to use consistently. Before I go, I just want you to remember that your worth isn't determined by having perfect skin. I want you to have the knowledge to make the best choices for your health and your skin so you feel empowered every single day. If this video helped you to understand LED therapy better, go ahead and share it with somebody else who might be curious about using LED face masks as a part of their skincare routine. Come back and let me know what your feedback is. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you guys next time.